Hi everybody, Eric Swanson with Duraburp here in Orange County, Central Florida, where of course we bring you Duramax powered GM SUVs. Well, we have something very special for you today to review. This is the all brand new Duramax Suburban from Duraburp. Now, this is a brand new 2017 one ton Suburban. We've built several 2016s, but unfortunately because they are for government use, we were never allowed to take any photos or any video of them, but we've spent the last year developing this truck. This client was kind enough to allow us to take some video and pictures of it to, to show what the truck looks like. It is, as I stated, a 2017 one-ton Suburban. You may recognize this vehicle. It was the one that you saw disassembled in one of our previous videos, highlighting the, uh, the frame and the type of suspension system. But as you look around the vehicle, you really wouldn't, it's, you really wouldn't pick it out for anything special. Short of the stainless steel tailpipe and the Duramax emblems, it really doesn't look any different than any other Suburban. Now, you will notice that it does have the 8 on 180 lug pattern wheels. They are directly from the 2500 HD and 3500 single wheel Silverado. Uh, it also has the same braking system as the Silverado and the same ABS system. So this is a pretty strong powerhouse. Uh, the vehicle is powered by an LML and it has a few enhancements as well that we'd like to share with you. You'll notice when we look under the hood, as with Durabur products, everything is in the right place. It looks completely stock. Now, the only thing that you see in this engine bay that looks a little bit different would be, of course, we have the SMB cold air induction. We need the additional air because hidden underneath the cowl behind that resonator is Duramax Tuner's new Stealth 64 for the LML that moves approximately 50% more air than the factory charger. The advantage of that is not only performance, but also when you're towing, it lowers your EGTs drastically. You'll also notice that we use the uh, Banks hot pipe. That also helps with EGTs to keep the air cool. And then the transmission that's in the truck is an Allison 1000 that is built by Suncoast. And it's been treated with some goodies to help it to keep up with the performance of the vehicle. So this is a Suburban that can tow like a mule and perform like a stallion. Now, when we look inside the vehicle, you'll notice a few features that have been added to enhance the driving experience. And inside the new Suburbans, uh, of course, they have all the standard functions. If you've been looking at any of this body style, you know, that, that come with any of them, they're pretty much all the same. You have things like, you know, park assist, lane departure traction management, but one thing that's unique about this is even though it's an LML with an Allison, it has auto track 4x4. The advantage of auto track, as we've noted many times before, is that, of course, it's like an all-wheel drive system, so it automatically turns on and off as needed. Now, why don't we jump inside and we'll show you the push to start system. So you push to start creates a little bit of a problem because, as with any Duramax, you have glow plugs that have to warm up before the engine can start. So we've artificially created a negative, I think, 25 degree situation for the engine by using a resistor on the temperature sensor to make the glow plug system work. So you'll notice when I go to press the push to start button down here, and I put my foot on the brake, you're gonna see the glow plug light come on over here on the dash and the engine will not start until the glow plug light goes out. There you go. Now, there's only one problem with this setup, and that is that if you ever have a situation where your glow plug, you have a glow plug failure, then of course the glow plug light will stay on and for the entire start cycle. That notifies you that, hey, you have a bad glow plug. So down here below in this area, it's kind of hard to see in the video, I apologize, but there's a switch right here. Now, if we push that switch, 
it overrides the entire glow plug circuit. So you'll notice when I put my foot on the brake and I push the push to start, it's going to start instantly even though the glow plug light comes on. So that way, if you ever have an issue with glow plugs, you can override the system. But while everything is functioning correctly, you can just simply get in, put your foot on the brake, hit push to start, and the vehicle starts up. Now give us one moment and we're going to remove the resistor and take you for a test drive. Okay, now that we've got our truck back to normal, we can go ahead and run through the press to start operation one more time. You'll notice the vehicle starts instantly because in actuality our temperature is already climbing up. So, all right, let's go for a test drive. You'll notice that you retain everything like you normally would on a Duramax. You know, your tap shift is down here in the lower right. Uh, you have all the functionality inside the, uh, the center cluster just like normal. There are no funny messages or any, anything in the information board. The vehicle simply functions just as it should. Now, this is also equipped with a DSP-5. The client has had it discreetly located right here, down below. So um, it can also be located here in the center console, if you wish, just about anywhere. It just depends on where you would like it. Um, so now, these are really, really nice trucks. They have great performance drive wonderful. With that 65 millimeter turbo, acceleration is just absolutely excellent. So, and you get to enjoy all that power and performance along with right at 21 miles to the gallon. So, it's, uh, it's very fuel efficient on the interstate. It's a terrific daily driver for the wife and the kids. And it's the perfect hauler for going on vacation and, and towing things so yeah let's just have a little bit of fun as you can see it's no slouch and it has no problem seeing 100 miles an hour so, if you're looking for an SUV that is a lot of fun to drive, and you're looking for fuel economy, durability, and just an all-around nice SUV, this is probably the ticket for you. Now, diesel SUVs aren't a necessity for everybody, but... They sure are a lot of fun to drive, and they're a lot of fun to own. So, if you're looking for the ultimate diesel SUV, here you are, the all brand new 2017 Duramax Suburban. Thanks for taking time to watch our video.